What's up YouTube, it's Jay Millionaire here, uh, doing a video I should have done like a week ago, just haven't had time. So I'm compiling all the things that I've gotten together from I think week seven maybe. Um, it's a while ago, like I said. But anyways, let's go through it, because I usually make a video on all the stuff that I get, so I might as well do it. So let's get into the stickers first, before we get into actual items. So gotten in a parachute from week one, because they're still handing those out. Also, still got one of these, um, I guess, scratch off bogos, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's a pretty good condition. Usually they're all bent, so that's pretty cool too. Um, the other stickers I already have uh, is this monk tea. I think I have like five of these. Uh, one of these, I think I got like two of these as well, like the new, what is this new shit for, from Authorized Dealers, Supreme. Eh. And then I got a couple of the life tea, or life stickers, and bug Reggie's in, in there as well. So let's get into some of the items. So as you've seen from the stickers, this is the Life Tee. Fall 119, of course I got it in white. Um, they had some other colors that were pretty dope. The other, I guess, second best color is like a heather pink they had. Um, but the white, in my, in my opinion, with uh, the graphic and the colors, it's the best. They had some other colors, some funky stuff. But yeah, basically the first one is guy smiling with some tits in his face. He's happy, living life. Second one is kind of like, man, I don't know what's going on. Kind of muted face and nuclear bombs dropping. So, of course, dying. And then the last one, of course, he's sad and he's going to hell. I don't know if this correlates with that, but, I mean, living in between and then death. So, it's life. Um, good, okay, and then bad, I guess. I don't know. Cool. I don't know if I'm going to wear this anytime soon. It's a cool... Damn. My dog jumped runs upstairs. Um, it's a cool idea and cool piece. I forgot who the actual artist is. Let's see. It probably says on the back of the piece, they say... Um, no, this one doesn't have that where it shows the artist. So yeah, some artists, um, yeah, I don't know. If you know, let me, let in the description or you can look it up. It's not, not important, but cool design. I think there's a Supreme right here underneath, which is kind of cool in that, that different font. Um, pretty cool tea in my opinion. And the white's the best color. So that's what I got. It's probably still online if you want it. It wasn't that hype. On to the actual hype, um, I guess winter tea. One of them, at least, the, the one that sold out is the Pillows Tea. And of course, this is, I guess, Supreme spelled out on pillows. It looks like some people said sushi, some furry animals, monsters, whatever. But I got it in the, what is this, dusty green? Dusty teal. So this is one of the best colors, I, I think, in my opinion, with the graphics. They had like black, of course, white, and some other colors, but the dusty teal was a hitter, in my opinion. Um, some other stuff that came out that week, uh, ended up getting, one of the big logo beanies in Heather Gray. It's just a basic ass logo beanie, but this is better than I think last year's they had the 3M because 3M kind of looked nasty, in my opinion. And then I got the green or the forest green. It's not a lime green, it's actually dark green, um, which is one of my favorites, but the gray is just something that's classic and uh, you can't go wrong with beanies. Just some basic ass beanies. One thing that I did love from the drop that I've been waiting for since I've seen it in the lookbook, and it's actually a pretty good uh, tool set. The one there's two different stickers over there. Wonder what the one behind there said, but basically it's the Chapman screwdriver set. Um, yeah. So as you can see, it's a regular, a little small, probably like uh, two hands, little set. Um, Supreme on the outside, that hard kind of like uh, I guess hardware box, like you would have a drill or something, a black and decker uh, drill box or something, and it says made in the USA since 1936. So let's open this baby up. And it has some other stuff in here as well. Um, what is this? Uh, just basically showing about the company. I guess inspected and signed and some other information about other tools and blah, 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 blah. Other thing is, of course, the torch torque chart and the actual uh, order of all the bits and the tool set inside the actual box, which is cool. Um, and here we go, the actual tools. So, or tool, rather. So, the cool thing is, this one has Made in USA on here. And instead of Chapman, it has Supreme Manufacturing Company, which is kind of cool. And I'll show you how this works. So, you take the handle, and you put this little bit in here. Locks in, not really well, but it locks in there enough to screw. And then you choose your, your choice of bits. Let's just choose a random one. Uh, it has a little ball uh, bearing on it, so it basically clicks in pay place. Um, the bits in there, I guess, a little more secure than the actual thing to the handle, but either way, they're in there and you can use it um, just like a regular screwdriver. So, 
yeah, it's pretty basic. It's just a regular screwdriver. There's no actual torque or um, a ratchet set into the screwdriver like I would hope it would be, but it's just a regular screwdriver. Just super mini and uh, portable because this is really small. So that's a cool feature. Other thing is if you have to use a bit, like let's use the same bit, and you got to get a spot where you can't get the handle in there, they come with this extra ratchet set. Um, I'll show you this one here. So Supreme Manufacturing Company out and then in, and then with some other etching on here, Charles Chapman Tool Stainless, uh, number five, whatever, whatever. So you basically slide this mofo in here, and then you can actually ratchet, and then if you have to go the other way, and vice versa, vice versa. So that's one's basically you can hit the corner or hit a, a round angle versus just a regular screwdriver. So it is useful. I literally use it like the day I, um, I got it on something. So I will be using this one and that's why I was excited for it. So yeah, this is probably the hyped item, one of the best items so far this year because it's literally something you can actually use. Um, this live tee wasn't that hype, but I think overall it's a pretty good tee um, image and on a white tee, you can't go wrong. Uh, this pillows tee, I'm not that crazy about it, but it's pretty hype. It's one of the only tees that sold out and this is a unique color. So of course, keep in that. And then of course, you can't go wrong with some beanies. Uh, forest green being a really dark one compared to the other greens they usually have, which is light. So that one's actually pretty nice. And a gray, you can't go wrong with the gray because I don't think they've had a gray, Heather Gray beanie, a regular one without all the information or other extra stuff on there. So a lot of stuff, but not really a lot of stuff. There were some other things that dropped, but like I said, if I didn't go after them, I didn't really care. I think they had the, like a Bible T, oh, Jane, I'm screaming. A Bible T, I think a, like a black history tea where a black lady was shaming some white promiscuous women on a billboard or whatever, whatever. But yeah, late, rate, comment, subscribe. Like I said, this is super late. So um, probably already seen all this stuff. But uh, yeah, let me know what you got from the drop and thumbs up. Peace.